What's up? My name is Tiago Duarte and welcome to another video tutorial here at Telebits. In today's video, I'm going to show you a new menu that I found out by accident here in FL Studio. And I think I've never seen it in any other tutorial on YouTube. So I think it's something a little bit obscure that uh, a, a lot of people do not know, but I think it's a very, very important, not important, but uh, a very handy menu that you can use to speed up your, your workflow. Before we start, I would like to ask you to subscribe and activate the notifications so that you know when I upload new videos. And if you have any questions, just leave a comment below. And uh, consider supporting my channel by buying one of my products at telepits.pt or become a premium or exclusive member. So let's go ahead and start the or go to FL Studio so that I can show you the the um, the menu that I discovered. And uh, here, as you can see, I have one of my bits that I, I, I created. And I found this menu by accident. Just uh, uh, one time I was working on FL Studio and I accidentally uh, put my hand on the mouse, but it was not a smooth uh, thing. It was more like uh, when you, you kick your, your mouse with your hand uh, or you slap your mouse with your hand. And um, I click two buttons at the same time accidentally and it show, showed up this menu here. As you can see, this is the menu that uh, you can uh, enable here and it's very handy because you don't have to go to here to change the, the, um, the for instance, the, the mode that you are on. For instance, draw, paint, delete and mute. You can also memorize some of the um, shortcuts and also the, the names here, for instance, as you can see here, the draw is P, but the thing is that you have or you must have, you must disable this, uh, the, the keyboard uh, so so that you can use these key sh shortcuts. So if I now click on P, I'm just playing the sample that is selected in the channel rack here. So yeah, it's not a very smooth way, so you have to disable this and then you can click click p and it will it moved to draw so if i click on b it will move to paint so this is something that you can you have to disable to uh, be able to use the shortcuts in the the keys of the your keyboard but this menu here is very simple you just go here and you click this one and then you are in this mode if you want to uh, for instance uh, enable the the um, the slice menu or slice mode you can just go go ahead and cut whatever you want with that and it's very very easy this this menu usually you have a in your mouse you have this the wheel and the wheel has a button so you click on the button and then you click on the on the um, right button of the the mouse and this menu will appear so again you just click on the mouse you press the mouse wheel and then at the same time you click uh, with the with the right button so let's go again you click on the 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 mouse as you can see uh, the wheel as you can see it enabled the the hand where you can move around the playlist but then if you click if you keep the mouse wheel pressed and you click on the right button you will have this menu and as you can see you have pretty much all the other menus here so this is a very nice a very nice uh, uh, shortcut that you can use that can speed up your workflow for me at least it's it uh, it worked really well when for instance i'm working on with audio with the uh, audio vocals or audio recordings uh, and it helps me for instance let's say i have a full audio here and i want to cut this instead of doing like the you can do the shortcut here but if you have a lot of stuff for instance if this is a small clip it's okay to use the shortcut but for instance i can go here and click and like that and basically if i want i can disable this for instance I can move this around, which is quite nice. You can you have much more control over your clips, and uh, pretty much you can do whatever you want with this uh, menu. It's a very nice menu, and I don't think uh, I've never seen it uh, people using it. So 
I think it's a very, very handy menu and I would like to share that with you. So this is it, guys. It was a very fast video. I think it's one of my fastest videos. But uh, again, I also sp uh, spoke a lot in the, in the video just to show you the, the menu. But this is my style of video. And uh, yeah, I hope this tip was helpful. If you have any questions, just leave a comment below. If you are new to the channel, uh, subscribe and activate the notification so that you know when I upload new videos. I hope this tip was very helpful and I hope you start using this, this uh, shortcut more and more. And if you are new here, consider supporting my channel by buying one of my products at dailybeats.pt or become a premium or exclusive member and you will have access to exclusive tutorials about music production where I show you uh, pretty much everything that I know about music production, I will pass you my all my knowledge and you will be able to really fast start making better music. This is it guys, my name is Tiago Duarte and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.